usual lighthouse. This is our first time shooting the lighthouse since last winter. How weird is that? Oh my gosh. Yes. Yes, oh, there's one there too. I get here and the wind's going west. It's gonna be a good afternoon. Wrong window. I, I went the wrong way. Wrong too. way. Just, okay. just so wrong. I'm gonna do. I'm doing everything wrong. <laughs> we are back at home, at the lighthouse. I have just like an absolute. I have my whole Tupperware of winter stuff, not organized, and I have no clue what's what. Five mil. I'm gonna go hooded four three. Oh hey, come here. Oh yeah. We got shirts for Jeffrey. Oh, you're filming. Yeah, always filming. Sick. Black and white. Oh, that's your new that's shirt? That's right, baby. Yeah. What's up, y'all? Welcome back. We're home from Hawaii. The waves are firing over there. Those guys can have it. I'm stoked for them. I am glad to be back home here at the lighthouse. And we've got some swell right here before Christmas. It's looking super fun. The Cape Hatteras High school surf club is out there in full force, and so are the rest of my friends. And so I am excited. I'm gonna throw on my little four-three hooded hyper freak suit. Super light. Water's not too bad, I don't think. And uh, ride a little swallow tail. Go do some turns. This guy. We're reunited again. You don't do. Brett and turns. Jeffrey. I don't do turns. <laughs> I definitely don't get. I definitely don't get barreled in Hawaii. <laughs> <laughs> Not this year. Not when it's that windy. Yeah, you guys, welcome back to Hatteras. Waves look fun. I'm gonna change. Let's get going. Moving it up. I gotta get the lighthouse in the background. The usual lighthouse. This is our first time shooting the lighthouse since last winter. How weird is that? We got some cool water foo. Always foo. The best. I'm excited to surf the lighthouse. <laughs> I, kind of whiffed I was like, there's no way I'm paddling out without gloves. It's not bad. But and then Je Jeffrey was like, yeah, I'm hot. Like, I, I wish I just had four, three, no gloves. And I was like, well, I don't believe you, so. Yeah, <laughs> not the case. <laughs>
one. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh. I mean, Welcome home. Doesn't get any. I mean, it obviously gets better wave wise, but it's just beautiful out. First session back at the at the fight house. No fights today, luckily. All good vibes today. <laughs> Happy faces. I was not planning to get up early for tomorrow, like for like the small little window, but now I'm like, there's a small little window and it's bigger. He <laughs> kind of does. here at the lighthouse waves look fun it wasn't looking that great and I wasn't gonna surf but it's getting better so I'm gonna go out but the wind is about to come on shore really hard pretty soon so I told Jeffrey not to come down and shoot um, he may come surf we'll see but uh, gonna go just have a little soul session with the boys tomorrow's looking like better winds so we'll reconvene then for now I'm gonna get suited up go have some fun sorry you're not gonna get to partake in this session but uh, sometimes you just gotta go have some fun <laughs> not worry about filming Well y'all, welcome to our little shipping center for the Life on Water merchandise that we set up here in the house. Thank you so much for everyone that's placed an order. We're just so excited to be sending this stuff out. It's been really fun to learn the whole process, packaging up shirts. We got 100% compostable bags that we send them in. We got tubes for the posters. And yeah, this has just been a super fun adventure. So it's all because of you guys and wanted to say thank you. And I surfed yesterday and it was a blast. I'm gonna be honest. I uh, had regrets that I told Jeffrey not to come film because it got way better. It was super rippable. It was literally as rippable like for lined up waves as it gets at the lighthouse. Like most of the time, if it's peeling enough, you could do a bunch of turns, it's too soft. And if it's walled up enough, you can do d good turns, it's too fast. And it was the perfect speed. And uh, it felt good to be out in the water back here at home, even though I wasn't filming. I mean, sometimes you just need those days. I mean, shoot, there was a day last winter, it fired and it was me and a couple people out and Jeffrey and I didn't film. He was surfing up in Red Anthe and I was getting like overhead barrels and didn't document it. Sometimes you just need that. You need that separation. Like as much as I love surfing and filming and stuff, I need that separation from work to just do it for the love of it. And so that's what yesterday was. But now I'm gonna get these orders out because the waves are good today. The wind's turning offshore. We got some fun surf in store for the afternoon. I'll finish these up and then let's get going to the beach. <laughs> oh, it's offshore now. Ah. Oh. <laughs> oh my God. Yes. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so there's one there too! Oh! 
All right, you guys, nothing more to see. The waves have turned on. Literally an hour ago, the wind was terrible. That's why I was just taking my time at home, packing up orders. When I was leaving my house, Jeffrey O'Neill called me and said that it, it was like kind of firing. And I get here and the wind's going west. It's gonna be a good afternoon. So time to get changed, let's go. <laughs> check somewhere else out because where we were at the tide got too low and I'm seeing some good ones down the beach uh, at the lighthouse so we're gonna run down there we got one hour of light left here's hoping we can go get another two before the day is over
Buxton. Well, y'all, we're here at the Fish Cleaning Table parking lot that goes out to Ramp 44 here in Buxton. We are gonna go try to see the Christmas star. Well, sort of, because last night after we got done surfing, it was so cloudy we couldn't see the Christmas star, which is Jupiter and Saturn aligning. Um, so here tonight, we're gonna go try and see them as close as they were last night. And uh, I'm just waiting for my wife to get here with the kids. We're gonna drive out to Cape Point, which overlooks the ocean. So we should have a good visible shot at seeing it. Uh, I'm gonna try and shoot a time lapse or at least some long exposures and, and capture it in action because it won't happen for like another 800 or 1200 years or something crazy. So anyway, I think they're pulling out right now. We're gonna hop in the truck and go check it out. Specific moon to get around the sun once. Really? Yep, 100 Whoa. years. Where'd you learn that? So it's Jupiter and Saturn. Jupiter and Saturn, not Venus. Jupiter and Saturn. Well, y'all, we are out here at Cape Point. I'm gonna get the tripod set up, use my star app to figure out where the planets are supposed to be. They should be somewhere out that way. And uh, get ready for the sunset and hopefully getting a glimpse of the Christmas star or at least Jupiter and Saturn uh, for like 30 minutes before it goes behind the horizon. But I'm gonna sign you guys off from here. Um, what just a fun swell to get back in the water at home in. First time surfing since Hawaii and got to surf the lighthouse. Didn't get to surf the lighthouse all fall and, and that was just such a fun swell. It was rippable and there were some little barrels and it's been beautiful. Classic winter time, just fun swell. Nothing crazy, nothing stressful, just enjoyable with friends. I love it and stoked to take you guys along for the ride. Hope you guys enjoyed that. But I'm gonna let you go from here, hang out with the family, get set up, try and shoot a time lapse of this and yeah. Hope you guys have a Merry Christmas. Thanks for all the support. If you haven't been, be sure to hit subscribe so you can follow along with these weekly episodes. The rest of y'all know the deal. See y'all next week. Oh.